House will come to order. The final hurdle for a bill banning abortions in Ohio playing out in high drama on the House floor. Friends, we truly live in desperate times when the most dangerous place for a human life is in the womb of his mother. Highly debated. And they are making these decisions about their own bodies. <laughs> Extremely controversial. This is a step based upon science upon which most of Americans agree. They agree that a heartbeat indicates life. Coined the heartbeat bill and called by some the nation's most extreme abortion ban. Once signed by Governor DeWine, it bans abortions after a fetal heartbeat is detected. That happens as early as five or six weeks into pregnancy before many women even know they're pregnant. Women will be forced to make a decision between enduring financial hardship and dangerous, illegal, self-induced abortive care. And in the nine years that we have waited to pass this bill in Ohio, we have aborted 207,000 babies. Representative Lisa Sebecki testified that she was raped and impregnated by her rapist, pleading with her colleagues to vote no. This bill does not allow incest and rape to have abortions. Ultimately, the House passed the bill 56 to 39 as the galleries erupted in protest. The Senate followed suit just an hour later, 18 to 13. Now, one of the biggest opponents of the bill is Planned Parenthood. They released a statement to us tonight, reading in part, Ohio's six-week ban is a dangerous policy designed to block abortion access before many women even know they're pregnant. These actions will roll back gains to public health and harm women's health and the health of families across Ohio. Planned Parenthood will not back down from this fight. Now, opponents of the bill also have already vowed to sue. Reporting live, Jatara McGee, WLWT News 5.